And here's the plan. We got to my house. Jake's got a dead mouse or something dead in his vehicle. I don't really smell it anymore. I've gotten so <laughs> no Okay, this, okay. Here's the deal though. <laughs> this guy's got a freaking air freshener right there hanging up. He grabs that thing with his fingers like that. And then Jake, what do you do? He gra grabs under his nose, you cheater. Freaking cheater. So I'm going to grab my dog and we're gonna see if he can spot out where this dead carcass thing is. Prince, we got a mission for you. Come here, buddy. Come here. We got a mission for you. There's something dead in here and we need you to sniff it out. Prince? Smell it. Prince, what's in here? What's in here? It's not me. Where is it? Where is it? Smell it. See, he's, he's at it. He's onto it. Look at him. Look at him. He just wants to go for a ride. I'm not a police dog. Today you are, friend, so saddle up, partner. See, he's getting under here. All right, it's getting worse right here, definitely. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Seth, you think you're onto it? We got Master Sniffer Seth. It's right here. You found it? Well, look at all these bugs. Look at all the bugs. Oh, it's really bad right here. It's right in this area. It's, it's right here. Take the clips off. Pull them things off. It's, it's like right here. Look at all the bugs. We're getting rid of this thing right now. Not, yeah, we are. Good job, it's Seth. Right Whatever's stinking is underneath here. That's just the start of it. So let's peel this up and look. Oh my God, he's touching that right now. That, one, that really doesn't stink. Prince, buddy, let's go inside. Come on. Your sniffer didn't work too good, huh? That's okay. We, we think we found it. You're off duty. We're gonna reveal this thing. Dude, right underneath this thing. Right? You went and got your kitchen scissors. Yeah. You prepare food with to look for a dead mouse. Yes. We can wash them. We're eating meal at your house. This says the guy who's picking up stuff and sniffing it. <laughs> What's the difference between you eating off of that and eating off of that? You wash them, right? Maybe it's not a dead carcass. Maybe it's just rotting dog food. You actually found a mouse. Right there. Oh yeah, she's. He's belly side up. He's gooey. It's Ew. gooey. Ew. <laughs> We're not using my shop back. We're going somewhere else. Let's go to Robo. I'll even pay for it. We're just gonna leave it like that. We don't have to take it. Do you want to just get an extension cord and rent, use mine? <laughs> this is like mouse hunt in real life. Is that him? Well, does it stink in there? Kinda. Seth, smell this. Here, you smell it. It does stink a little bit. Oh, that stinks. <laughs> Come on now, are you kidding me right now? He couldn't smell that. No wonder he wasn't looking for it. Smell Seth, that. just smell it, Seth. I'm look in there, I'm gonna smell it. Yeah. I think it's just rotten dog food. No, it's a dead mouse. I got a package in. The guys and I are about to go to lunch, but I wanna open this first. Is it, is it? Yeah. It's a professional tripod. We just got done with lunch. The smell has yet to go away. I think we just picked up some like rotten dog food. Jake and I are playing Block Us. This is the game. We're playing two players, so we each gotta play like two colors. I beat Jake the first game. Jake, how do you feel about that? I think he's pretty ticked off because he owns the game and I beat him. Yeah, I'm not very happy. Um... <laughs> Normally I win every time against most people I play, but... <laughs> Got him! He'll probably beat me this time, though. Am I getting the shot? Well, the second game was, uh, neither one of us did very well, and, uh, it turned out that I did end up beating Dalton, though, by one square. Here, let's see a single one. One of these stupid little squares he beat me by. You? What the frick? But we ran out of time, I have to go to work, so we're not gonna be able to do a best out of three series, unfortunately. Ah, man! Next time. I'll beat you. No way! Place your bets right now in the comment section below. Who will win, Jake or me? Are you team 3D Machines or team Jake the Toilet Snake? Get in there, doggies! Oh, my. Sit. Sit. Molly, what? Sit inside. Hey you guys, after cleaning and vacuuming Jake's car out, it, it still smells like a dead rat. 
a lot of people want to see me work on the BMW, a lot of people want to see me work on the Kodiak, a lot of people probably want to see me work on the KX. Leave in the comment section below, which one do you want me to work on? Whatever has the most comments, I will work on it next. Maybe. <laughs> Drake might have found some money on the road. This thing right here. I think it, what is it? That's a mink. It's a mink? It's roadkill, but it's a mink. But hey, we show it with the viewers real quick. All right. What is it? It's a mink. There you go. Are you gonna eat that? No! So this animal was already dead. Well, we did hungry. not kill it. No animals were harmed in the making of this video. We strictly turned around and looked, and sure enough, there was a dead mink on the floor. They're actually pretty. On the ground. They're pretty. They're pretty. I think so. They kind of look like a ferret. Yeah. <laughs> it looks bad in the video. It's a pretty animal. It's a pretty animal. I, I agree. Hey, guess what? Now we actually do have a dead animal in the vehicle for sure. That is right, buddy. <laughs> This one doesn't stink though. Yeah. So for anybody that is like offended when it comes to harvesting an animal, like in New York State, we have a bunch of hunters where we are. Like we're not in the city, so people shoot deer and you know harvest the deer. See, if we just if Jake just left this mink on the road, it would have just rot, or some animal would have eaten it, which uh, you know that's completely acceptable. But Jake is actually he's gonna take advantage of this dead mink and harvest its fur. Yeah, it's not going to waste. And we didn't harm an animal, so for anybody who has any kind of thoughts on that, we just want to settle that now. Don't lose that thing in your seats, and don't let that, you know, start stinking up on you. I just got to grab my camera out of the back. Yeah, I'm going to have to pick up my helmet and my other stuff some other time, but thanks for the fun day, dude. We have to ha hang out more often. Okay? We'll see you later. Jake and Seth are fun. We are definitely going to have to hang out more often. Before we wrap up this 3D Machines production, I just want to do some fan mail because I'm extremely behind in fan mail. I have like a huge stack of stuff you guys have sent. Now that I'm ungrateful, just haven't been able to put it in a video and make it kind of blend together. Now I have had some people that like my hat and I'm sure there's a couple people that dislike my hat. I haven't seen any of those comments yet, but I I don't have anything for or against the team. I just like the color black and purple. So, so let's start this fan mail off. It's a bag of nuts. Who sent me these nuts? Thank you. If you want to share the fame, you can send stuff to my P.O. box. It's in the description. Basically, we share the fame. I don't think my dentist would appreciate this, but thank you very much. I do like Starburst. This is a lot of candy. Thank you though. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What's your guys' favorite color? I think I like pink. Maybe yellow. I'll eat it anyways. I dropped it on the ground. You guys know I'm not very picky. I have enough Starburst for the whole crew. No name though. Somebody's definitely gonna have to send me some mouthwash. <laughs> machines and always keeping it froggy fresh thank you very much this is cool there's no name with this one either Cole you want some starbursts I got five pounds of them he says he wants to see what that looks like that'll rock your teeth out all right <laughs> feel free to take at least one absolutely thank what, you very what, much what's your I favorite color it. what's your favorite orange That's orange is yours yep I, I I like pink I think is my favorite and then Pink's my good. second is yellow I think somebody's probably all ticked off that we don't like red <laughs> Last one, and then I'll get out of your guys' hair. Actually, I don't know if this is a good idea. Holy smokes. Holy crap. I found the card to the this box with the shirt. Hey, Dalton, hope you're feeling froggy fresh. I am after having that shirt. I have watched all your videos. Thank you very much. Hope you like the gift. I do. Love your personality, keep it that way, never change for no one. You got it. Thank you very much, there is no name though. It looks like we got a bunch of gloves. Somebody wants me to get down and dirty. Some cutting fluid for like taps and dyes. Some lubricant. Who do I have to thank for this kind care package? Dalton, my name is Jason C from Seattle, Washington. Thank you very much, Jason. The gloves are the ones I use when I'm working on my Cummins. I hope you're not too offended that I own a Duramax, but thank you very much. This is 
They are ribbed for your pleasure. If you know what that means, you'll probably find it funny. If you don't know what that means, just trust me, it's funny. The orange can is croil. It is to loosen up rusted nuts and bolts. It works a lot better than PB Blaster. We're gonna have to experiment with that. Keep up the great vids and stay froggy fresh. You got it, Jason. Thank you very much. That concludes this small portion of fan mail. He also sent, um, he also wants to get some 3D Machines decals. We'll hook them up. I hope you guys enjoyed this 3D Machines production. I personally did, even though we went through Jake's car and it smelled like a dead mouse. It ended up turning out pretty sweet, if you know what I mean. Enjoy your day. You stay froggy fresh. 3D Machines out. <laughs>